Okay. It's been a minute since we had a swatch fest, so I'm still like, is it working? Is it working? Hi, welcome to Swatch Fest. I have three little packages we're gonna haul. And then we'll get started. So last week we had we skipped Swatch Fest. <clears throat> Joy got invited to her first birthday party in a year and a half. It's been a long time. Hi friends, come on in early birds. Let's make it say live chat. Welcome to live chat, welcome to live chat. Let's see, my thing at the top doesn't show me if I'm in live chat or top chat anymore. It like, it's scrolled to the side. So, hi Carly, welcome. It has been forever. So I just keep saying top chat over and over, I don't know. Hopefully it's working. So make sure you're in live chat, not top chat. For some reason, my just says top chat. I can't switch out of top chat, but that's why we're gonna go off of the majority instead of just me as far as the winners. If this is your first time at Swatch Fest and Chill, welcome. We're gonna swatch some things. We're gonna chill. We're gonna have some giveaways for nail polishes. And where is my phone? In the pockets of my bicycle shorts. Bicycle shorts are my jam 20, summer 2021. That's pretty much all I wear. Um, let's see. We have not had a lot of swatching videos on my channel in a few weeks. So let's see what we're gonna do for giveaways today. It might be a lot of random giveaways. So, I didn't think about that before. <laughs> started this video guys I have the MSM collection that we can do a giveaway for and then we're gonna have to have four random giveaways after that so I hope you guys are down for it um, because I didn't swatch anything else on my channel this week oh you know what we can do a giveaway for we can do a giveaway for Carolina's um, polishes that I swatched that are um, for like the charity box HHC that are going on right now we can do a giveaway for those I didn't do a video for it, but I swatched them and they're going up on my Instagram today. So we could do a giveaway for that. Um, how is Tim doing? Hi, Susan. Heart Susan. Tim's doing good. He just got all of his stitches out yesterday and um, he got like that situation cleaned up a bit. I don't want to be too TMI for anybody who's going to gag when I'm talking about that stuff, but um they say he's looking really good. He's returning to part-time work on Monday. He's still not allowed to lift anything, um, you know, heavier than like a milk jug, but he's doing really, really good. And he's going to look into getting, um, getting back driving <gasps> for the first time since November, you guys. I've been driving him and anyone in my family that needs to go anywhere. I've been the sole driver since November and it's driving me nuts. So... Um, I'm so excited for him to start driving again. His neuropathy is in his left leg, which unless you have a clutch car, which we don't, you don't use that left leg while you're driving. So I think that should be fine. And I'm excited. Your house is projected to be finished mid-August. You're still want to, <laughs> I know Brenda, how are you going to, well, are you moving far? Cause I've moved for, I've moved 4,000 nail polishes a few times in my life and it's a pain in the butt, but totally doable um you just have to package everything up pretty good so i just went to um i just went to walmart and grabbed one of those big rolls of packing bubble bubble wrap and then what i would just do is i set it i rolled it out and then i would just do like um like a three a line of three polishes like doop, 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 like this. And then I rolled it up and then I would do three more polishes and then rolled it up and then it would get rolled and rolled and rolled. So it was like a big long thing like this. And then I put it in the in a Tupperware like that. And then I did like, I would do like layer, layer. I don't know if I'm explaining this very well. Maybe I should have filmed it a little bit when I moved. That would have been smart of me to do that last time I moved to film it, how I'm packaging up and moving all my polishes. That probably could have been pretty helpful. Um, but it worked really well. And I, I think, 
out of the 4,000 bottles, I really only had like 10 maybe break. So not even break as much as spill. Like they, I had more leakage than breaking. Hello. Hi, everybody. Melissa says it's so hot in Maryland. Hi, Tika. Hi, Vicki. Hi, Nicole. Oh, you haven't been to swatch us in a month. Quila. Hi. Hi, Janet. Ooh, Rhonda packaged each one in its own bubble wrap. See, I couldn't do that. I wouldn't have the time for that. But if you started, you know, like months and months in advance, you probably could. Hi, Caitlin. Mix along is not going to be next week. We're going to do it on the last week of the month. So this month there are five Fridays, five Saturdays. The um, new Moonshine Manny items that are launching this month are on the fifth Friday, the 30th. And that's just the Facebook custom and the MSM comeback, which is going to be when beneath my when beneath my wings, when beneath your wings, when beneath my wings 2.0. It's on my thumb actually. And um, those two are going to launch on th on the Friday the 30th, and then we'll have mix long on the 31st. So next Saturday it'll be a video like this. On the 31st it'll be come make polish with me. Please come, please come and play with me. I want you guys to come and play. Hi, Ethan. Hi, Bite Sized. Hi, Birdie. Birdie, I just got done talking about Tim, but he's doing good. That's the quick recap. Three Marylanders in the house. Yes. You're having a bad thunderstorm, Vicki. I hope we don't lose you. We have had thunderstorms. Uh, we had it on Wednesday and Thursday. Pretty kind of crazy heavy thunderstorms almost late, late in the evening coming towards dinner time. Hi, Vicki. Tika, I love all these little lobsters. You guys are so cute. Liz says, so hot in California, the AC at work broke and it was 80 to 4 degrees in the building. Oh. Horrible. 65% humidity for Jerry down in Pensacola, right, Jerry? Or is that your mom? <laughs> Marylanders, party time. Okay, so 31st, put on your calendars. 12 noon Pacific Standard Time, we're going to make polish. I want you guys to come make polish with me. You got to be thinking in your August frame of mind when it comes time to make polish because it's basically going to be August when we're making polish. And what do you guys want to see? So next month's Moonshine Manny collection is called A Trained Chanteuse. It is for, um, it's for uh, Moira, obviously. So instead of doing a full Shit's Creek collection, I'm just focusing on Moira. She's my favorite anyway. And we're going to go start, we're going to go start and bleh, we're going to get dark and moody. So that's one of the Moira polishes there on my third finger. I got to take these off because we're going to swatch. But I'm already feeling in a dark and moody place. Um, so September, nope, August is going to be a trained chanteuse for Moira. September is going to be Hitchcock Halloween. So just so you know, I'm already in a super dark um, frame of mind and I'm very excited for fall. So your mom is in Alabama. That's right. Okay. You're eating homemade berry sorbet. Yes, Janet. Yay. All of us birthday babes in August. Louise, are you feeling a little bit better today? I'm guessing since you're here, you might be feeling a little bit better. Hi, Amy. Okay, so I'm just cleaning off my nails and we'll get started. We've just been chit-chatting. Oh, also I want to open these three packages too. Looks like I have HHC. I have Polish Gamers Box. Oh, and I have the, um, this is from Polish for Days. It's the uh, For the Love of Polish box, which is inspired by, was it Sunsets? I had to get it. It was inspired by Sunsets, I think. And I also got the Phantom Flakies box, but it's not on the way yet. And um, it is for Animal Crossing, so I had to get that too, obviously. Okay. If you're in the mood to do a little shopping this weekend, I had this, um, I'm going to start calling it Fab Friday Fun. Yesterday we had a little game, all of the Moonshine Manny products, that's including merch items, nail care items, were all marked down a dollar, anything that started with the letters and the word summer. And 
instead of getting up this morning and adjusting the website, I just played with the girls and we just had a fun morning just chilling. Um, Joy and I were working on some math. She's getting ready for school. She's so excited. So it's still running today in case you want to take advantage of that. And that does stack with your um, PPU code. With those of you who are members to this channel, that stacks with that. You get additional savings. You just put your membership level in the comments of your orders and you get savings. Um, and I haven't looked in a few minutes, but I don't know. There might be a few bottles of Beach Balls and Bicycles left. The um, July Mystery Protos launched yesterday. So... And no, I'm not going to show you what they look like today because I want them to be a surprise. Okay. Hi, Kim. Hi, Helena. Hey, Kate. Good to see you. Evelina, hi. Hey, there's Kate. Kate and Kate. Your fancy new blue icon. Oh, Kate. Look at all of you with the blue icons. Those of you who have been members to this channel since the... Um, since we first started, I think that's your six month icon. Icon, icon. Okay, my nails are finally clean. All right, let's see what I ordered from Polish Gamers Box first, shall we? So if you're just hopping in, we're basically going to be doing a lot of grab bag giveaways today because I haven't done a lot of reviews on this channel in the last two weeks. So we'll give away some other things. Okay, so it looks like I just ordered three things. Where are we? This is a nice heavy duty bag. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, so I got the Night Owl Lacquer. Oh, this is from the Minecraft box. Um, Lindsay did such a good job with this one. I found diamonds. It looks exactly like a diamond um, box, block. It is so cute. We'll definitely swatch this today. Then the next thing I got, something with a star. You're a star, baby. How cute. Oh, I got another BCB lacquers. Should have known it was her from this cute bag. What did she do for Minecraft? Let's see. Um, creepers. So this is a, sorry, this is a blue jelly base and then it is filled with green and blue elements. Wow. 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 You love strangers on a train. There's so many rear windows is definitely one of my favorites. And my collections lately have only been four pieces plus a, um, add on. So it's not obviously going to be an all encompassing collection. I just have to pick my five first. And my um, polished gamers box that month is no. My polished pickup box that month is going to be Psycho. So Psycho will not be in the collection, the main collection. You read my mind. I don't remember what. Oh, you read my mind. <laughs> You read my mind. I remember I thought that was so cute when I saw it on the website. Okay, next up is HHC. HC. H. That reminds me of a show where there's like, there's some HC and the person always pronounces it as H. That is making me think of something right now, but I can't think of what it is. Do, 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 do. Okay, there are, I think, two people I still needed to hear from about giveaways. GL, if you're here, you are one of them. GL, I still need an email back from you about May 22nd, <coughs> the Zoya giveaway. I still haven't got an email from you if you're here, GL. And Diana, Diana, we haven't seen you in forever, but I need an email back from you about um, June 19th. I think two weeks ago when I mentioned the Zoya giveaway, I did say that I wasn't going to keep trying to find you after that day, but look at me mentioning it again because I forgot. Okay, Night Owl Lacquer Din Rao. This is from, I don't know what the inspo is. 
but this is from Night Owl Lacquer. And this is very similar to um, Coral Fixation, actually. Pretty darn similar. It's less pink, but yes. My Christmas in July episode is up wearing I Can't Even Afford to Be an Elf. How cute, Kayla. Leanne Angel, you also got the gin and berries. I'm going to swatch as much of them as I can. I usually end up chatting too much and I don't swatch everything I mean to. Kim, Tim's doing good. Thank you for asking. He just got all of his stitches out yesterday. I got this rogue lacquer. Don't be such a guppy. The little mermaid. I had to get this. Look at how much it looks like flounder. So cute. And next. Chasing Dreams Studio Ghibli theme from Nailed It. As you can see, I was attempting to get things in the beginning of my rainbow box. So this is an orange kind of creamsicle packed with... Um, gold green flakies and last but not least it is a mystery I don't know what it is swamp gloss yes I am such a swamp gloss fan right now okay southbound and down archer vice June 21 this color wow that is really punchy that is gorgeous okay last last uh bag this is the for the level polish um july bag i believe the night owl lacquer is zelda hi shelly shelly helped design our facebook custom which is coming out we were talking about that a little bit early ago so when you love it just remember that shelly designed it okay i can show you guys it in a little bit but kate helped design our eat beach sleep repeat which is um according to if you guys pick something up that helps me know if you love it you guys really love that one so really really excited and kate designed that one so this is polish first light first light so i believe this was a sunset box which is why i had to get it my august ppu is inspired by sunsets Every time I take a picture of a sunset because I'm sitting there looking at it and just dying over how gorgeous it is, it never quite turns out as gorgeous in my picture. Like when I go to look at it from my phone, it's like, oh, it's just not the same as in person. Sunrise Serenity. <gasps> sunset Serenity. July for the Love of Polish box. I thought it was going to be called Sunrise Sunset. Sunrise Sunset. Okay. Then we have Sundown, Sundown Serenity, <laughs> it's funny. Okay, beautiful gray, blue gray with um, lots of gold flakies. And then we have pink gold green in there too. I think it actually just might be a pink gold green flaky. Okay, now we're finally done opening stuff. Let's swatch some things. So we're gonna do the first giveaway is going to be a um, random giveaway. One second, let me grab a bag. Let's grab a bag, oh, let's grab a bag. La, 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 Okay. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to grab from these two bags because... Ooh. Okay, I'm just going to grab stuff. What is this? Hmm. Well, you guys can't see if I grab that. Why are some of these already in bags? I don't know. As long as it's Christmas, blah, 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 blah. Okay. Here's the first random grab bag. I just pulled this from a couple of bags I have over here of stuff I'm already getting ready for the next mystery de-stash bags. But, okay, so we have Essie Zest has yet to come. Essie, this is yet to come. Polish Persimmon. 
ILNP Sage, Calorosa Carol, Tiki Beach, and um, Olive and June, Grateful and Kind. So this is what your, your first giveaway is for. If you can think of at least two shades in here that you would like to have me send to you, enter the giveaway. If these don't look like your bag, just don't enter this giveaway. and Just wait for the next one. So really quick, the rules, be 18 years or older to play. So because you're going to be sending me your address, when you email me, you need to send me your full name, first and last name, your address where I can send your, your winnings to, and um, your two top choices of what you want. So that way I can actually send you the stuff. If you don't hear from me after a week from your initial email, just send it to me again. The timer went off. Are you ready to be done? No, but I'm... Is it not working? I have to do the stickers and email. Coral fixation, mm -hmm. it like spasses off and I don't know if it's on. Oh, okay. So I'm paying on her right now to swatch my polishes, guys. And she's doing an awesome job at it. But this includes using my labeler, which is really fun. So, and pretty soon you're going to run out of that. And I know where more is, but I'm doing a video right now. So if you need more help after this one, let's just wait till I'm done, okay? Okay. Okay. There you go. I was just going to do like... Thank you. B17 already. Okay, you're awesome. And, and then I was going to like go ahead, paint more, let it yeah. dry, paint more, let it dry. I'll cut it. You're amazing. Thank you. Okay, so, um, yes, those are the things you're going to send me. You're going to be emailing me at moonshinemannycontact at gmail.com. Thank you, Kayla, for putting that in the comments. Um, you guys all said hi to Honor because of the delay. She just missed it all. Um, so, what was I saying? You're entering one number between 1 and 100 in the um, comments. You're trying to get the closest to what the random number generator picks without going over. In the case of a tie, we'll go off of majority rules. That's why after I have said stop, you will go back and look and see who got the closest. So you're having to enter your number between my typed word go and my typed word stop. And let's just have fun, right? Let's just have fun. And thanks in advance for all of you who are being super good sports when you get really close but don't quite win. And... Um, Let's just play along and have fun. Hi, Yika. Hi. Hi, Lindsay. Yes, that labeler is good. Rhonda, I've bought like three over the years. I keep using it. Okay, so the first uh, giveaway is for that grab bag I showed you just now. So ready, set, go. Yes, only not one number per giveaway. If you see that somebody else picks the same number as you, you cannot erase it and pick a new one. The first one we're going to swatch is JMB. Your, you read my mind. I love it. I love it so much. So cute. So the board game Polish Gamers box is currently available. It runs from the 15th through the 20th of every month. Um, so definitely go check out that. Moonshine Manny is not participating this month or next month, but there is lots and lots of good stuff. I just swatched Carolina's. It is sorry themed. Um, and super super cute i'm gonna pop those up on my instagram soon and thank you to our moderator louise for helping moderate the comments section she is a rock star next let's swatch night owl lacquer actually we need pink so let's do this one swamp glass southbound and down southbound and hella handmade creations is also going on right now so that first one was from Polish Gamers Box. This one's from HHC. So head over to their website to see what's going on over there for more exclusive polishes. This is so pretty. This is no longer currently available, but even though I swatch exclusive retired shades, um, it does show you what the brand's like, you know, strengths are and stuff, and you can look for other things that the brand makes it'll probably be something similar ish to what you're seeing me swatch today really love the shade of pink that's really pretty i have um very pale but bright orange on my toes right now what are you guys wearing on your toes i went from i had like a pale lavender 
to now I'm wearing a very pale light um, orange. Okay, they look so long, thanks Vicki. Because I'm keeping them in this kind of shape, they break a little bit less often. But if you can see, there's a break right there that's trying to happen. But thank you. Okay, now we're gonna swatch this Night Owl Lacquer. This is a neon orange Crelly packed with pink, gold, green flakies. So pretty. Toes are naked right now, says Quayla. Charity box runs through today also. Thanks, Brittany. Is today the 18th? I thought the charity box ran through the 18th. I had it in my mind. I need to post for Carolina. Okay. Gorge. Gorge. And I do happen to have a yellow sitting right here. So now we're going to swatch this road, lac road lacquer. Rogue Lacquer, Don't Be Such a Guppy, also from June HHC. Sparkle like you mean it from Fair Maiden, PPU, bright sparkly blue on her toes. Yes, Helena. Danielle says, I'm wearing Polish for Days Silver Mist and Solasta on your toes. Are you kidding me? Do you ever not look at your toes while you have those shades on? Solasta is one of my faves. Solasta. This is a beautiful mustard with green micro flakies in it. Green, green to blue. Green to blue, green, 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 green. You're getting tired of the gel. Thanks, Caitlin. Ziggy by Penelope Cruz. It's a blue teal, says Shelly. You might do a bright yellow. That sounds good. I haven't done yellow on my toes in forever. I need to do that next time. Okay. There's your stop. You have crazy plant lady on your toes. Yes, Matanda. Love that. Okay, here's my random number generator. See, it is currently set at zero. Kate, I missed it. I missed what you said. I'll look back in just a second. 24. So you're looking for the closest number to 24 without going over. Kate says, Jody's wearing maroon. <laughs> Nothing on toes lazy this summer. I still don't see your comment, Kate. There you are. Aww. Your friend passed away. I'm sorry, Kate. That is a really beautiful tribute to him. So every single time you look at your feetsies, you can remember your beautiful friend. Rhonda Neon Nish Purple with a Glitter Topper. Wow, that's some dazzly toes. Okay, you guys are super fun. Okay, we need about 20 or so people to get an agreement. You have MSM, MSM Elf on your toes. Aww. Okay, so when we get a consensus, start a new note. Today is the 17th. Okay, let me go grab those Carolina polishes really quick. I want to show them to you. Talk to you about it when I get done, okay? <laughs> oh, you're so funny. When she's working for me, she's always like, how much money did I make so far, Mom? How much money did I make so far? Okay, so the charity box, I'm gonna grab up Carolina's notes really quick so that I tell you the correct dates on when these are available. Do, do, do. Okay, so the charity box, this first one, is called um, Two Can Do It. So this next giveaway is going to be for Calorisa Carol, these special polishes that she has that are available for just a short time. 
If you win and you have already purchased these, just let me know and we'll grab you some more colors to Carol you could choose from. So this is this really cool, um, like creamy lime green with all of this awesome stuff in it. This is only available through the 18th for the charity box, okay? Big black shreds in there, beautiful. Um, from, I believe at HHC right now, this is currently available the new kid in town and this is her final polish in the spider-man series this also has black shreds it has all of these red hollow glitters or they might be clear hollow glitters but the red base is really strong beautiful this is only available through the 21st whatever day hhc ends i believe it's the 21st Polish Gamers Box, which is only available through the 20th. This is the polish inspired by Sari. This has nearly the same base as this. But this one is um, a little bit more white leaning. And it's filled with all these beautiful neon or bright colored, like primary colored dots. I believe they're dots. No, they're hexes. My bad, they're hexes. And then there's this um, iridescent shimmer running all through it. It's really pretty. So this one's called Sorry, Not Sorry, Baby, I'm Sorry. And then this hasn't even launched yet. It launches tomorrow. This is from the Little Box of Horror website, which I don't know very much about this um, limited edition box. The Little Box of Horror is July 21. This is called Just One Bite. This one <laughs> I think was my very favorite because it's gray. It's this beautiful kind of like taupey gray. And then it has this purple like glow and it has all this hollow, copper hollow glitter in there. It has these bright blue uh, flakies. This one's so pretty. So this doesn't come available till the 18th. But all of the things in this giveaway, they're all limited edition things that you can't get anywhere except for the specific websites. Make sure you go follow the Calorista Carol Facebook group so that you know about where everything is happening. Okay, so here's what's up for this giveaway. Giveaway number two is going to be Calorista Carol. Let me write this down. Okay, a little box of horrors takes longer than other boxes to ship, says Liz. Maybe it's coming from farther away. Here's your go. Okay, I did write down Benty. Thank you, Kayla, for helping me make sure I've got my stuff straight. Okay, second coat of Jen and Barry's You Read My Mind. This is so pretty. Um... That's really pretty, you guys. It has some flakies that are bringing in some pink. So, so pretty. So last night, we went to dinner at this place called Backdoor Burger. And um, we were choosing between these two, like, kind of artsy uh, places. We went to go visit my old college. And I went to go, like find my old uh, apartments and just kind of be a little nostalgic for a night oh my gosh this is gorgeous you guys are you in love with swamp glass as much as me they're like my new fave I love them so much <laughs> hi Victoria good to see you um so we landed on this place called backdoor burger and I was surprised it wasn't slammed but then it got slammed 15 minutes before we left and I forgot that college kids don't eat dinner so much at six o'clock and more like 7 30 or 8 anyway they have like five burgers on their menu and one special each week and they are the weirdest burgers but we got the um, PB and J burger it was so good I want to try making my own PBJ burger uh, because it was delicious so um we also got this one that had like caramel apples it had Cooked apples, like you'd put an apple pie on it in the form of like, I love tomato on any sandwich. I love tomato all the time. I just, I love tomato. But instead of like tomatoes on your burger, it had cooked apples on the burger. And then it had this caramel apple sauce. <laughs> it was so crazy. 
The least crazy one was a barbecue burger that had um, grilled onions, grilled mushrooms, and guacamole on it. And I never really think to put those things together. They kind of seem like separate ideas. But, oh, so pretty. Just, I, I gotta look at these up close for a second, guys, before I take them off. So pretty. Okay, my nose is so itchy, my gosh. Like, the last few times that we've had swatch fest, my nose has been so itchy. It's like the talking and the um, resonation of the sound is just for some reason. Okay, these are coming off. Say goodbye. PBJ Burger. I know, right, Wendy? So it's this delicious char-grilled burger that was already yummy by itself. And then instead of, like, mayo, they just put this very, very thin, small amount of creamy peanut butter. Um, and then they also put... Instead of like ketchup, they put this raspberry artisan jelly that also had jalapenos in it. It was so good. It was so good. Anyway, what we did was we ordered three burgers and then we quartered it and so everybody could just try a bit of each one. That was a fun time. And then we went ramen burger. Oh, Nicole, I got to try that. You should like, you should tag me on wherever you see the, the recipe for that. That sounds awesome. Then we went to the little ice cream shop where my mom used to work. My mom and I went to the same college and where she used to work when she was in college. And uh, that was fun. And then we went and looked a few of my buildings where I had a lot of courses. Then we went home. It was fun. This little bit of cuticle that's threatening to destroy me. Right now, if you're just joining us, you're entering to win the Colorista Carol LE polishes that I have swatched for, to go up on Instagram this week. Kate says, I'm not a summer lover, but I love a good barbecue. That's literally my exact vibe, Kate. Okay. Going to get four more shades on and then we'll pick the next winner. So we need green. Green, 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 green. I don't see green. One second. Okay, this green has been staring at me from my Swatch Fest bin forever. Simple Colors Cherry Oil Bite. It's just so acidy, and they have this beautiful green to kind of peachy pink shimmer in there that I really hope is going to show up on the nail. I'm a little worried this one's going to stain me, but oh well. It's just so mossy, it's so swampy, and then they put this iridescent component in there that is pretty textured, I'm not gonna lie, but it's cool. See, that's why I like Sinful Colors. I haven't found any of their new stuff. Oh, this is supposed to be a textured polish, it looks like. It doesn't say it is, but it looks very textured. Hey, Restored by Polish, why are you in the hospital? Hi, Sparkling Silver. Look at that yellow, that yellow icon. All of you guys with your yellow and your blue and your green icons. We've got some red members in here, too. Don't forget your membership gets you discounts on my website, and it does stack with the current summer sale that's going on right now. Okay, there's our green. Let's do this BCB for blue, shall we? This is called Creepers. This was from the Minecraft box. All the August babies. What if we call a polish at next Swatch Fest August baby? <laughs> then uh, that kind of makes a bunch of people who aren't August babies kind of. It won't matter as much to you. Oh my gosh, I have that song stuck in my head. <laughs> we don't even really watch that show at our house, but it comes up on Netflix all the time. I think it's like the mermaid song or something. Wow, this is pigmented. This is gorgeous. Focus. Ooh, that BCB lacquers. BCB lacquers, yep. 
Okay, purple. We already swatched rose lacquer, so let me snag a purple. Can't get it out of my head. Okay, I found a purple and a neutral while it was up. Jody, you have two August babies. July 20th is Candace's birthday. Almost there. July 23rd, Brittany. Here's purple. This is Iridescent Poodles from Native War Paints. And it's filled with iridescent glitter. Let's swatch it. I saw this polish on Allie's nails. Allie Yvette and just died. Looked so gorgeous on her. I had to have it quite sheer on me, but I'm sure we'll build up a little bit more color if we did three coats. I, I said it's quite sheer. What I meant was it's not um, very purple leaning on me, but that's all right. Okay, 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 okay. Where's neutral? We're gonna do this different dimension. Mystery prototype 283. So her prototypes are on her website till they sell out and they are listed under their number. So it's only a mystery when you buy it. But you could go literally search for this one and maybe get it. This is glow in the dark. It looks like she probably made this in preparation for the new ones that she just released, which are all glow in the dark, I think. So different dimension, 283. It's a white base with yellow and pink glitters. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You know what is like smothering my Instagram feed lately is all stuff about the new Sex in the City movie. <laughs> is anybody getting pushed those pictures like so, so much? Maybe it's because I clicked on one. So Instagram was like, oh, we need to send her 5 trillion more pictures about this. <laughs> okay, here's stop for the CDC. For the CDC. It's like, um, yep, we still got our numbers. It's like a Monsters, Inc. reference. I always think of uh, Carolina as CDC in my head. Okay. Thank you, Gloria. I love your oval nails, too. If you guys follow Gloria's Instagram account, you need to follow because she does awesome nail art over there, and I'm just always like this on my phone. <sighs> like, I'm not even joking. Okay. Here was last number. New number for giveaway number two is two. <laughs> giveaway number two. Okay. Look and see if anybody put one or two. You had to change your store zip code to order the new simple colors. Thanks for that tip. I'm going to go look it up right after this. Okay, while you guys are looking for the number, I'm going to do a second coat of Simple Colors Bite. I have something really, really exciting to report to you guys. So two of our amazing nail polish friends here in the group heard my call heard my pleas a few weeks ago at swatch fest where i was telling you guys about the shades that are really high up in you guys's thumbs up comments in the project dupit collection that i just can't find anywhere and one of those is the se mercury and retrograde duo well i don't know if this person wants me to say who they are but a member of our group sent me her bottles so that I could dupe them for Project Dupe It. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for you guys and for me. Um, so we'll have a duo for those coming up here in the next few months. They'll definitely make an appearance in Project Dupe It. And we had a friend of the channel and you guys' friend here on Swatch Vest send me a sampling of the Color Club polish that is super high up in the request. Um, the name of which is eluding me right now. It's that super exclusive multi-chrome, Color Club multi-chrome with that 
raspberry base and that strong goldy green shimmer. I could spend a second looking it up, but you guys probably can think of what it is right now. And I now am able to try to figure out that for you guys too. And I'm so excited. And that one's going to be a scented polish. I am going to do my best to get very close. But honestly, I think that's going to be the hardest part is getting the same scent that was used because it's kind of hard to tell what it is. Look at that cute different dimensions. I'm loving these. I have to say, I think I was loving my first hand, the first hand that I did first though, or better. Can't use words. No words today. But take another little look at these while we decide who the winner is because these are about to come off. Okay. We have Bin Yen. Is this your first time? And did I say that right? Bin. Oh, like Bin Yay? <laughs> Yay. Okay. Are you here and do you see that you're the winner and you have to tell us where you're from? Oh, yay! You see that you're the winner. So tell us where you're from and then you're going to be emailing me at. My nails are wet. You're going to be emailing me there, Moonshine Many Contact. You're going to give me your full name so that I can send it to you with your address and your top two polishes from the Colorista Carol giveaway we just did. Yay! Susan says it's okay that I tell you guys that it was her that sent me the Essie Mercury and Retrograde duo. <gasps> Susan. Susan slayed my life. Okay, so say goodbye to these. Yay, Ben, tell us where you're from. And yep, you just email me and you get to claim some beautiful limited edition Colorista Carol polishes this week. Yes, if you didn't see the polishes and you just had popped in and put your number in, just when we're done, rewind the video to that part or fast forward and um, look and see what the polishes are being offered. Okay, these are coming off. So long, farewell. Agree, Louise. Agree. Did you guys see that Jackie posted um, in the Facebook group about Karen's video where she talks about those little coverings for your bottles? I totally went immediately and bought a set. Um, I'll probably have Honor do it. <laughs> hey, Honor, you want to work for me again today? Paint these and put these on my bottles. Um, actually, I really love tasks like that. Like, minute detail tasks that I can re repeat over and over again. It's very soothing to me. Um, but dang it, I just don't have the time and I start a project and then I don't finish it. And then I'm like, hey, Honor, you want to come help me do this project? Sure, Mom. Doesn't mean I get to buy more fidgets. How many of you guys' house is inundated with fidgets like my house? My eight-year-old and my five-year-old are obsessed with fidgets. <sighs> Susan, are you kidding me? <laughs> okay, Susan, I'm going to email you after this. <laughs> oh, gosh. You have a sample bottle of Simple Color Zeus? Brenda, what does a sample bottle mean? Okay, I'm going to I'm gonna repeat to you guys here what the other ones are. That If you look, there are ones that people really, really want, and I can't find them. So if anyone has... It's almost two. Well, you guys can go look um, in the announcement section. So you just go to announcements. The top announcement is about my Facebook or my polish pickup for next month. Here's how it looks. If that flashes, it's flashing out. There you go. It has a strong pink to purple shimmer. I'm inspired by sunsets. This happens to be a sunset picture. It's not my own, but it is a picture that I saw online when I was looking for sunset pictures. And then I was like, sun, I was specifically looking for lots of yellow, purple, and pink. And I saw this picture and I was like, easy. It's also from WOW. So um, that's what's coming up for August. So you just scroll down a little bit 
through the announcements and you will find um, the thing that says Project Dupe It. Submit your ideas for Project Dupe It. And you guys can look in there. And if you are an OG collector and you have some of these shades and you are incredibly generous, <laughs> I'm not expecting you guys to want to part with your polishes. I finally found a bottle of Butterland and Wallace the other day and purchased the exorbitant eBay price. But I that is another one that you guys really, really like. So anyway, go look through. Here's one. Uh, Max Factor, is it Fantasy Fire? That one, everybody requests that. I can't find that. I can't find that. There you go, Lucky Charm. I can't find that for the life of me, guys. Um, so yeah. If anybody knows, has Max Factor Fantasy Fire. Um, the Chanel polishes are really, really hard for me to find. Um, Clarence 230, you guys want that? I don't know how I would ever get my hands on that. <laughs> so, there are shades that I hear you guys that you want them. I just can't find them. So, anyway. All righty, Woo. We're going to get back. We're going to get back on topic. Woo East Coast peeps. Uh, Ben says she's from Georgia. Yay! Georgia in the house. Georgia in the house. Mm -mm. Georgia. Is the Max Factor the original, original unicorn pee? I think so. I don't know. I've never actually tried to purchase unicorn pee, guys, so I don't actually know where people get it from that claim that they have unicorn pee. But, um, it's a dupe for Clarence 230. Okay, thanks, Marlene. It's hard for me to keep these things straight in my brain. But, um, I forgot what I was saying. <laughs> oh, so, anyway, I'm able to get my hands on some very beautiful shifty shimmers. So, it's not so much important to me to find actual unicorn pee because there are lots of very shifty things out there. So, um, but that is some people's ultimate jam. If I were going to replicate those polishes, though, I would not be putting actual unicorn pee in them. So that's one thing to know. Okay, we're going to do our second um, mystery grab bag giveaway today. There are going to be three because I haven't reviewed a lot of things lately. So here's what's in grab bag number two. These are all the things we just swatched. So this Coral Fixation-esque Night Owl Lacquer Din Roll that somebody told me was a Zelda theme. So thank you for the person who knows that and gives me the background deets. I love background deets. This, you read my mind. It's so beautiful. But I know that one of you will wear it more than I will wear it just because I'm not as much of a red lover, but that is gorgeous. This, uh, Don't Be Such a Guppy from Rogue Lacquer. Um, beautiful. It actually looks more green than yellow on me. Beautiful. This purple iridescent poodles Poodles from Native War Paints. And this beautiful white Crelly from Different Dimension. Mystery Prototype 283. So this is what's in the third giveaway. If you think that you might like to wear a couple of these, then enter the giveaway. Just pick one number between 1 and 100. If you see that somebody else picks the same number of you as you, you just got to leave it. That's just how it goes. Ready, set, go. Okay, okay. What are we saying thank you to Vicky for? Aw, your profile picture is beautiful. Aw, I love that. You guys are all so sweet to each other. Okay, we're back to red. We need a red to swatch. We need a red to swatch. Uh, let's see if I can find a red down here. That is um pink. That is definitely pink. Mm -hmm. I want it now. Okay, I know we already did Night Owl Locker, and I usually try to do a bunch of different brands, but I've been really excited to swatch this. Night Owl Locker Suck It from Psych. I love this collection. I think I purchased the whole thing. It is so, so beautiful, and we haven't swatched very many out of it yet because I didn't do a review on it. Let me pull back in just a little bit. This is the red one from the Psych Collection, and it is very punchy. It's a punchy red. 
could maybe be technically kind of a pink but it's like a strawberry shade it's beautiful oh it's so beautiful it's too gorgeous for words okay next we're gonna do painted polish it is called okay bloomer okay bloomer okay this is like a muted bubblegum pink filled with copper hollow micro glitter. Bubblegum, bubblegum in a dish. Hi, what's up? So I put on every label that uh, I could get because uh, it ran out. Okay, you want to come say hi? They and said I hi finished. last time you were in here and you didn't get to see because of the delay. Did you say hi? Hi. Hey everybody, if, in case you're new here, this is my daughter, Honor. She's watching my polishes on polish sticks for me right now because she's awesome. So I finished. How much money do I get? <laughs> oh, I told you guys. How much money do I get? Um, let's discuss finances when I get done in here, okay? Okay, okay? All right, next we're going to swatch this Nailed It, Nailed It Chasing Dreams Studio Ghibli. July's mix along thing should be 1950s diner. I love it, Kayla. Do you guys have any other ideas that you want to do for a theme? Kayla says 1950s diner. It sounds so cute. That is the nailed it orange right there. And now I need a yellow. This is very, very green leaning, but I believe it's yellow. And this was from the RV There Yet collection, I think. It has a strong gold to orange shimmer and hollow flakies. <laughs> I think she, she, this, your comments all just popped up and now she's gone. Earning with chores, fun, yes. People did not like the ILMP because it was sheer. Unicorn P only looks good on dark colors, not light. It's a pretty special effect. Hmm. I, bet I missed a bunch of your comments. Oh, I think I have the magician. I'll have to look. Nicole, you have been sleeping on Night Owl. Definitely go check it out. I haven't swatched anything for them in a while, so that's why you haven't seen it on my channel as much, but I love, I love, I love, I love Night Owl. Okay, gorgeous. This is a really strong, almost metallic um, green gold orange shimmer going on in there. Wow, that's pretty. Both of my red to yellow hands have been awesome. Yes, Candace, I agree. Both. If you hit the like button, it won't hurt, I promise. Aw, he was so sweet. How about more musicals, says Connie. Nicole liked the 1950s diner idea. So you're both picking an, a theme for us to create polishes for, for August. Plus, probably Tim and I will show up trying to dress like that theme. Your kitchen is 50s theme. Aw, love it. Wow, I want to come see your house. Your dad was a teacher and he used to pay us 25 cents per class to collate papers to turn them back to students. Oh, that's cute. Okay, going back through. We're, oh, sorry, I said stop. Don't go back through yet. Don't do it. Pick a number. Okay, here's the last number. Giveaway number trace is 29. 50s dinner theme soda jerk. So cute. Yes, Candace. I held myself back from buying the whole collection, but it was awesome. 29. I just basically bought the stuff in the first half of the rainbow is what I did. The Raspberry Linear Hollow from the RV, their collection is amazing. Carly, I don't know if I purchased that. I probably should have because it was in the first half of the rainbow, but I don't remember if I purchased it. Okay, I'm super duper obsessed with this Night Owl Lacquer. This is maybe my favorite thing I swatched all day. It's so beautiful. It looks so juicy. 
And then because she put the purple to teal aqua kind of like flakes in there. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. Love that. Okay. This I'm pretty sure is still available on her website. Go snag this. This is called Suck It <laughs> from Night Owl Lacquer. Lisa Gonzalez. Okay, we need about 20 people. Next we have O Bloomer. O Bloomer? Is that what it's called? OK Bloomer. From Little Tiny. Oh, well, it's probably a Luna hair on my nail. Great, great. OK Bloomer from Painted Polish. If you like pink. See, this color of pink is like sickly pink to me, but that's totally just my brain interprets this color. But I purposely ordered some of the shades from this because she has some beautiful pinks in this collection and I wanted to swatch them in Swatch Fest. But that's Painted Polish. Third, we had Nailed It. Okay, it looks like we do have, you ordered the Night Owl Rewind shade too. Awesome, Casey. Casey Gonzalez is our grab bag number two winner. Uh, Casey, I said Casey, I meant Lisa. Casey's name was in my uh, brain. Lisa, are you a first time winner? If you are, tell us where you're from. Yay, congrats. Woo, 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 woo. It looks so good. Thank you, Nicole. See, I model it for you guys so you can see how it looks. And even though something may not my, be my personal color preference, it doesn't shy me away from purchasing it because I know many of you will love it too. I'm pretty sure this is still available. Okay, this is Gorge. It's so densely packed with flakies. Nailed it. Puts so much flakies in their polishes. So much so that it's almost too much if that's the actual thing, which, you know, Never too much flakies, but if you know what I mean, if you know what I mean, there's just so much. Okay, Lisa. Yay, Lisa's a first time winner. Lisa, where are you from? Okay, I'm gonna get a second coat of this KB Shimmer on here and it's gonna look so good. Hallelujah, hallelujah. I ordered uh, four new components that I haven't tried yet that are coming to me. They're in the mail, they're nearly here, but one of them is for, I'm um, coming up for a project dupit coming up pretty soon that I have in mind. And I got a new flaky that I'm really excited to try and two other shimmers besides those. A new multi-chrome that I don't think I have yet. Super excited for that. Out of all four of these, you like the painted polish the best. Nicole, you're too awesome. It actually looks less purple than that in person here. Here's what they look like. For some reason, my overhead camera pulls slightly more blue toned. That's how they look. Oh, yay, Lisa. Well, you can still tell us where you're from because it's been too long. We all forgot where you're from. <gasps> Thanks, Madame Delicious. Okay, say so long to these. They're about to come off. <laughs> Okay, the next giveaway, while Lisa's telling us where she's from, the next giveaway is going to be for MSM. And, um, oh, here's another picture Lindsay took for me of the polish pickup coming up soon. Oh, it's called Ooh Shinies. I'm really excited for it. Okay. Where? This is going on right now on the Moonshine Manny website, which I just thought I would tell you about really quick. It does say Friday only, but that's because I didn't get up early enough today to change it. So it's still going on today. And if you go to the Moonshine Manny website, I'm about to sneeze. I'm just warning you all. I'm about to sneeze. Um, if you go to the Moonshine Manny website and you click on this little thing here, that is the uh, browser or the menu. And I put all the items that start with the letters in the word summer in here. So here's what's new, which is where the, um, oh, looks like there must be a few bottles left of beach balls and bicycles in there. If you want the July $5 proto, there's a new friends collection. We'll just swipe through all the new stuff so you can see what's new. If you, if you win this giveaway, she's your lobster starts with an S. So she's discounted right now. 
Um, here's the new July sticker. I put on the on the website accidentally that it was a magnet, but it's a sticker. Um, Sarah designed it for me. Sarah usually designs my monthly merch. Where is it? It's so, so cute. I told her, let's get a sun-kissed mermaid on the beach with a nail polish bottle that she's going to paint her nails. And she's like, I just have to warn you, humanoid figures are not my forte. I was like, girl, I'm sure whatever you come up with is going to be beautiful. And she's like, humanoids aren't my best. Um, excuse me, this is beautiful. So I love it. It's a vinyl sticker. And, um, she's just so cute. And she's ready to paint her nails with a little MSM bottle. So, anyway, that's our new merch for July. But if you win this giveaway, you can pick any two items on my website. The, um, Paul, the rewind is still there for a little bit longer. So anyway, I was showing you the summer sale. If you click on that, it's organized. It automatically organizes things by best selling, but anything that starts with S U M M E R is in here, but you can go like this and click on that <clears throat> and sort it by alphabetically. And then You'll be able to, for me, that helps to be alphabetical because then I could be like, okay, here's everything that starts with an E. And then we go into M's. So anyway, that's that. But if you win, you can pick any two items. It doesn't have to be the things that are on sale. So ready, set, go. Any two and a sticker? Sure. Pick any two and a sticker. Sounds like a good plan to me. Okay, these have to come off now. Say goodbye to this side of the rainbow. I'm so sad. Okay, it looks like I need to pick a green. I need to pick a green. And I got everything else. So, let's find a green. Okay, so we've got Great Lakes Lacquer we're going to do first. I'm going to show you these while I'm, look at that. Oh my gosh, Great Lakes Lacquer. She packs a lot of shimmer into these shades. Then we're going to do Polish for Days. Next. Sundown. Then we're going to do Oh my gosh, this is just going to be the night owl swatch day because I'm about to do a third night owl. Next, we're going to do cuticula, but then we're going to end with this Minecraft night owl because I just have to. So apparently I try to do different brands except when it comes to night owl. And then my theory is just watch all the night owl. Oh, for sure, Carly. Hi, Jackie. I was telling everybody about your post you put in the Facebook group, and I instantly went and bought some, so thank you for sharing. Okay. Okay, you're getting your numbers in for the fourth giveaway, and then we're going to have one more, and I will send you on your cute little way. Okay, my nails are clean. Let's start with Great Lake. Great Lakes of Fire. Okay, so this is Love Wins, PPU December 20. From Great Lakes, and I still hadn't swatched it. <laughs> oh my gosh. Did you guys watch my video on my 21 favorite polishes so far from 2021? That was a fun video to pull together. And I tried to do 
I tried to give you a bunch of different brands and do, I could have done it one of two ways. I could have done like my 21 very favorite polishes, but I would have had a lot of brand repeats just to be honest with you. So instead I picked 21 of my favorite brands and picked my favorite of each of those brands. Next we're doing PFD Sunset, Sunrise. Ooh, I like this one. What a yummy gray shade and that golden pink in there is super pretty. I don't think this is available anymore. This was the For the Love of Polish. It's usually their subscription launches the same day as Polish Pickup. So whenever you're shopping for Polish Pickup, you can be like, oh yeah, I also need to go check For the Love of Polish. That's what I do anyway. So this was called Sundown. And then purple, we're going to swatch Cuticula. Purple and gold. It's called Great Fairy Kingdom of Legend Collection. There's so much gold. And silver, she's got those, those chunky silver hollow flakies in there with the purple. Oh, purple and gold. I'm going to rename that Christmas song. Instead of silver and gold, it's going to be called Purple and Gold. So I filmed a review slash overview video for that Louise Penny book series. I finished the whole thing. I read every book that's available. I think it was like 16 or something. Thank you to whoever it was that suggested it to me because it was such a great time. And if you love mysteries, I fully recommend it to you. I found diamonds is the last thing we're going to swatch today. Oh, I need to say stop. Stop. Oh, well, it's going to be siop today. Siop. Okay, the winner is two again. Okay, wait, I'm re going. Sorry, whoever put in two again, I'm re going. 91. 91. Hi, Miss Lee. You did, Sonia. You're going to love it. You're going to love it. Everything in there is awesome. So, 91 is what we are looking for. So, anyway, I filmed a video and um, I just totally recommend it. I haven't put it up yet because I just haven't. I've been focusing on some other things right now. Um, but it's all filmed. <laughs> I do have to edit it. I have to tell you, when I made the decision to go back to edited videos primarily instead of lives like we do here on Saturday, I'm really, really pleased with how you guys have been responding to it. I also much prefer my regular video style for video quality of swatching of the nail like you can see this okay but I mean <laughs> let's see if I can get it to focus let's do the next few swatches with it like this and just enjoy that um anyway the video quality is just so much better but I have to go back to editing things and <laughs> it takes so long. Okay, looks like we've got a consensus. We've got Amy K. Woo woo, Amy, congrats. Okay, our last giveaway is going to be, let me snag some things that we just swatched. Mm, 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 mm. Okay, I'm gonna grab some stuff from down here. Ready, 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 ready. Okay, I have a vampy one in here for you in case anyone's feeling vampy for the final giveaway today. Oh. And I'll hold it up to here. I remembered why I don't have my camera super zoomed all the time. Okay, so here's what's available for the fifth giveaway. Okay, so we have Polish Magician's Apprentice, the painted polish that I just swatched, OK Bloomer, and this Chasing Dreams from Nailed It that I just swatched. These three are in there. And then we have a boutique here, ILNP Bouquet Toss. And it's too small. I got to look at it. 
You're in my world now. Oh yeah, this was the Dr. Facilier polish that Morgan Taylor did. Morgan Taylor it did so great this year. Super, super love Morgan Taylor. So here's what's available to you for the fifth giveaway. So if you win, choose from these five. You might have to rewind to go remember what I just showed you. Okay. So on your mark, get set, go. Go for final giveaway. Okay, so now I'm going to try to not make you sick. There we go. That's the thing on lives. When I zoom it up really close, I have the tendency to be like, whoa, and then don't want to make you sick. So here is Great Lakes Lacquer Love Wins. And we're going to do a second coat of that while you guys are entering the final giveaway. And good luck to everyone. Congrats to all the winners so far. I hope these polishes just bring a little smile to your week, a little extra fun. Brings a, look how pretty, brings a little randomness to your week. I'm laughing because I'm just like, <laughs> it's so pretty. Oh gosh. She loves that. Um, it's almost like a sunset in a flaky. She's got that purple and then the, it looks like maybe Pinkie Pie flaky in there. But it, that's like a sunset to me. Pink, purple, and orange. Okay, trying to move slow so we don't get sick. Sundown from Polish for Days. I've been seeing all of the makers' protos that they are getting ready for the September trick or treat themed. I think it's trick or treat. Polish pickup. And you guys, this is my very favorite time of year for Polish pickup with all the makers doing Halloween themed items. It is going to be so fun. And I can't give you any spoilers because it's not fair, but I'm thinking specifically about the Polish for Days one right now. That's what made me think of that. Try to not make you puke. So I stopped reading the Louise Penny series. Super, super love. Highly recommend. I moved on to the Miss Bourne series, which I, I do love fantasy. I love fantasy more than I like sci-fi. And I was told that this fantasy series has a good mystery in it. So, since I like mysteries so much, I decided it would be a good combo. I read, I raced through the first Miss Bourne book in like a day and a half. It was great. It was kind of slow, but it, it, it uh, gets a lot faster in the last third. And now I'm in book two, and I really like Vin. She's a great protagonist, and um, the Second book starts out with this awesome fight scene. So, really recommend that series so far, even though I haven't finished it. Sorry, that was a second coat of the Cuticula Shade. This one is supposed to look just like a gold block from Minecraft. Nope, a diamond block, and she did such a good job. Such a good job. I have her Creeper polish, too, from when she did a Minecraft polish before. She's great at Minecraft polishes. Okay. So good. Does this make you want to go play Minecraft? All right. Louise, how is your favorite polish time of year? Me, too. Lucia's here? Where's Lucia? It's 102 degrees outside. Horrible. Okay. Is there a thread in the Facebook group for met recommended authors, books, and or series? In the Facebook group? I don't have one, but can you start one? Please start one. That would be wonderful. I would love that. Okay. So, I'm going to zoom back out now. Purple and gold. Purple and gold. Okay. So... Have you tried watching Lupin on Netflix? It's pretty good. Connie, no, but I'm going to go search that right now. Cuticula been killing it on PPU. I know, right? Hi, there you are, Lucia. Hi. Your kids have been playing Minecraft all morning. Nice. Oh, thank you, Lucia. It's good to be able to talk to you. Loving the extreme close-ups. Okay, good to know. Nicole, remind me next week and I'll do it again. Okay, guys, tell that I'm losing my voice. Okay, grab bag number three. I think it might have something to do with my new allergies lately. I've just been like sneezing and 
Whew, my allergies have been crazy, but it would make sense why it would make me a little bit more rough. Okay, I'm going to Netflix. It's called Lupin. Lupin. I finished the whole Loki show. No spoilers, but it was great. Um, I love Loki. I'm a Loki fan. I don't think that I loved the Loki show more than like regular Marvel movies. But it was still very good. And Owen Wilson was in it and he was great. Okay, Lupin. I keep getting distracted. Lupin. Let's read the synopsis. Inspired by the adventures of Arsene Lupin, gentleman thief Arsene, Arsene Diop sets out to avenge his father for an injustice inflicted by a wealthy family. Thank you for the recommendation. Is it a mystery? Oh my gosh, is that the guy from Lost? No. I thought it was the guy from Lost. It looks good. Thank you for the recommendation. Okay. Shelly says Loki was great. Lupin, that is. Oh, Wendy says you love it. Thank you, guys. I love the recommendations. That ring finger is pretty. I know. I'm going to go ahead and put top coat on these because I'm excited to wear them the rest of the day. Look at how that top coat makes that ease sing. Top coat, everything. Okay, okay. Okay, just another second to get your number in. Final number for the day. And then I hope you go out and have a fantastic rest of your weekend, your Saturday and Sunday. Do, 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 do. Sounds like my girls have started fighting, so that signifies to me that I have been secluded too long. It's time for me to go lay down the law. Okay. Awesome. Awesome. Chernobyl on HBO was really good, Bite Size says. Okay, so this one is Great Lakes Lacquer, um, Love Wins. This is Polish for Days, Sundown. This is Cuticula, Great Fairy. And this is Minecraft. <laughs> this is Night Owl Lacquer, I Found Diamonds. <laughs> this is Minecraft. Ooh. Really? Every Day with You and His Adventure is your favorite one? Aw, thank you. Okay, let's pick our final winner. Oops, I dropped. I dropped the sticker. Okay, this was the last winner. Here comes 43. Who picked 43? 43, 43, 43, 43. Jackie, this would look amazing on you. If you're shopping over at Cuticula, you should pick that up, girl. Yes. Mayor of East Town. Oh my gosh, I just dropped more. Susan, I've been wondering about that show. Was it good? Because I love me some Kate Winslet, and it looks like a mystery. The more we share, the more we're gonna get. Do, 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 do. Who can name what song that's from? It's an animated classic. <clears throat> you love Mayor of East Town. Second that recommendation. Okay, thank you. You heard it was awesome, the Chernobyl one. Do, 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 do. Swirly twirly gumdrops. Oh yay. Mm, bring lots of tissues. Hey, let's get a consensus, but it looks like it might be Liz Lizzie. Gorgeous, huh, Brenda? 
<laughs> Mayor of Easttown is excellent. Wow. Three people give it 10 out of 10. And Nicole does too. Four people. 41 is your age? Fun. Okay. So I'm going to write it down. That's going to be it for today. Have fun with the rest of your weekend. Congrats to all of our winners. And thanks, you guys, for joining me today. Thanks for keeping me company while I swatch these things. Come back next Saturday. Um, so China Glaze, the China Glaze Fall Collection is on its way to me. We'll probably have a review for that this week. Orly Color Pass is also it's on its way to me, so we'll have a, re a review for both of those this week. Um, and then, I don't know. We'll have to see what else. What else comes out? I haven't seen a lot of stuff come out. I've seen... The Ferris of the Mall collection is at my grocery store, but for like $9 a bottle for Essie, I just, I don't really want to pay $9 a bottle for Mainstream. I'm sorry. I just, but I don't see it anywhere online. That's a good price. Um, I did see that 88 Beauty has up the Essie ice cream, ice cream. Let me look it up. Here's 88 Beauty. So, this collection. And I was looking at it and I was just like, oh, I feel like those are all repeats of stuff they've already done. And they're $6 a bottle. I can get Essie even cheaper through Polish Pick, but I haven't seen Essie on there yet for this collection. So, I haven't snagged it yet. But if any of you are like dying to see me swatch this, let me know. And if you guys see new collections and you're posting about it or whatever, tag me so that I can and be like, we want you to swatch this. Show me what you want me to swatch. So that's the thing. Okay, friends. To help the, find the symbol colors, you can search. Oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yes, have a safe weekend, and I'll see you next Saturday. Thanks, everybody, for coming by. Thanks for thumbs up in the video. That just helps uh, me be more visible to other people to watch, so I appreciate it. Jackie says Color Pass is on its way to her, too. And I will miss you guys. Bye, Lisa. You're welcome. Wonderful. Go have fun with your grandson. I will see you guys back next Saturday and for the China Glaze and Color Pass video this week. And I hope you stop back on by. The Essie looks boring. That's a, that's a from Susan. Good to know. Oh, they're all the same one, Brenda. Girl, good thing I have you here. Good thing I have you. Save the bills for something else, Michelle says. <laughs> okay, friends, so much love. Have a fantastic weekend. I will see you back later. And um, yeah, go drop your favorite books, your favorite book series. Um, it's Kristen, right, is going to start a feed for it over in the Facebook group. Um, OPI is releasing downtown LA fall. Yes, that's true. Okay, friends, I miss you. I miss you so much. I'll see you back again next weekend or stop by for some videos.